What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to some more The Walking Dead Season 4 Episode 10 is here today. If you did not get the memo, I took Episode 10 from Wednesday and put it to, to Thursday. Okay, so you guys will be getting this on Thursday. Okay, so in the last episode, Episode 9, you know, was the episode about Carl. And Michonne, um, Carl trying to do stuff on his own, almost getting killed twice by walkers was not a fun time at all. But in the end, Michonne did find Carl. But then again, they did not show. They they can't. I, I'm 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 still. You know what? I'm just gonna I'm I'm gonna say this because at the end. Someone saw them through the through the window. It might not have been Michonne. Because the way how they filmed it, it could have been somebody else. So I still don't, I'm not going to say that until I see her walk through that door. Because he got up and he said, it's for, it's for you. So it could be Michonne. I'm not saying it's not. But what if it's somebody else that saw them through the window? You get what I'm saying? Because the house that she went to, was it that house? I'm trying to remember if it was that house that that they were that they were in. Because I think she went to the house where he was eating the pudding. Not the one where they actually are because that's not the house that they 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 they, they in. So, let's see if it's some um, misdirection I'm hoping that it's not you know what I'm saying because ended the episode thinking that Michonne has reunited with them but the way how they filmed it it could be because I was re-watching um, I was re-watching the reaction and I, and I was saying at the end of the way how they, they filmed it it make it seem like it could have been somebody else outside the door that saw them in on the inside. So I'm wondering if it's somebody else. Could be somebody else, but we'll see. Rick said seems like it's somebody that Rick knows. So we'll see what takes place. Anyways, um, there's not much to discuss about the last episode, so we're just gonna jump into this one. Um, you know, story continues. We're still on the run. We're resting. Rick is healing up. You know. Carl thought he was dead. <laughs> he said, Good. I can't do it. Just take me. <laughs> this shit was hilarious. Anyways, let's jump into the next episode. I will see you guys for the review. All right. Season 4, episode 10 gave us a idea of what's going on with everybody who survived, who did not. Um, we're still, um, I told you guys, like, before, I told you guys that I don't think anything was wrong with Judith. I was a little worried, but I didn't think she was dead. She's okay, thank God. The two girls are okay, Ty is okay, Sasha is okay, Booze Man, you know what I'm talking about. Um, Carol is back, so that's good, too, um... And we know Rick, Carl, and Michonne is okay. Glenn is okay. Carol is okay. Um, I mean, not Maggie. I mean, Maggie's okay. Beth is okay. Daryl is okay. So all of these people, the main characters that we've come to know and love, they're all okay. So we're good to move forward. Uh, glad that they gave us an update on everything, but nobody really knows where anybody is. So that's the problem. I think they're going to meet up, meet back up eventually, but at least we know as the audience that they're okay. R.I.P. Herschel, you know, so don't have much to say about this episode rather than more like, you know what I'm saying? It was more like a continuation, giving us an update and, and letting us know that the main cast is okay for the most part so we know that um the lady that came back put a bullet and killed the governor she did not survive right she did not survive i thought she did 
you know, but she did not survive because I don't remember seeing her getting mauled. If we did, I must have missed it. But in any case, Glenn, you know, I, I just even remember that Glenn didn't know that Herschel died. He didn't know. I just remembered like he wasn't there. He wasn't outside or anything because he was sick. So when the place got attacked, he just went to the school bus. But I didn't know. I was like, how the hell? He, he, he actually did. He actually left to go a little back to, to, to look for Maggie. We didn't see that. You know what I'm saying? Because the last we saw him was him hanging outside the door of the bus. <laughs> you know? Um, so the bus basically got attacked or whatever the situation is that happened there. I don't know. Um, that was kind of odd to me that a, a big ass bus like that, unless they ran into a horde, which is not unlikely, which is not unlikely, you know? So we'll get to see that soon enough as the season go on. Um, I think we have about, um, we have like six more episodes to go for this season. So we'll see where they take it. Okay, so we're just getting an update on things. And then they met a new group. Don't know who the hell these guys are. But I do know a couple of those actors, though. Do know a couple of them. Um, especially um, the one that spoke. He, I remember him from, he was in Band of Brothers. So I know his cat. I know I know him. I know him as, a, as an actor. I've seen him in other things, too. But, you know, just recent fresh memories. I know that he's from that series. Anyways. Thank you guys so much. Not much to say here. I just want you guys to come here, check out the check out the reviews because I need to get watch time back up on the channel. The watch time has been dropping like crazy. Like I'm people are barely watching any of my videos. It doesn't matter if it's you get what I'm saying like more on the other side of things like anime and stuff like that. People are just they're just coming to the videos and just clicking on the links. Um, I'm not saying that's you per se that is watching this review right now. Just understand that I would love if you guys just watch the video, leave them playing in the background while you go and watch the reaction or something to help if you don't, if you're too annoyed to listen to the sound of my voice at a review. Cause I know I don't play music. I, I don't put music on my videos for a specific reason i know there is non but i just can't find non-copyrighted music that is very cool to put there i you know i, I had one but i got tired i got tired of it so if you guys want music on my reviews let me know let me know if that would be that would make it more inclined i know i don't do stuff like i don't do jump cuts and stuff like that to do my reviews because i want them to be as natural as possible you get what I'm saying? I know that jump cuts is the is is the cool thing, zooming in, zoom out, you know what I'm saying? Like to keep the viewer interested, but for me, I just don't have the time to do that kind of editing. I would because I you know what I'm saying, I'm able to do do it. It's very easy to do, but I just don't have the time to do it. I want to just boom boom grab the cl grab the clips, put them together in the editing software and just render it out. So I, tr as you notice, I don't even have to edit anything anymore because I've gotten so comfortable with being in front of the camera that I don't even make that many mistakes anymore. I'm not even saying, ah, uh, uh, um, uh, I'm not even doing that that much anymore. So I've gotten so used to it where I'm consciously doing better. So to totally understand that. So. Next, what we have on the agenda is episode 11 coming up very soon, at least sometime next week. So make sure you look out for that, okay? So thank you guys so much for tuning in. As always, it's your boy Terabyte Reacts. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. Leave a like, leave a comment, and I will catch you later. Peace.